Today, only half of plastic waste can be recycled. But what if all plastic could be recycled and used over and over again? Protecting the environment and reducing our need for fossil oil. That is the vision behind the Catalytic Hydrothermal Reactor, or CAT-HTR. Developed over 10 years by Lysella, this remarkable innovation chemically recycles end-of-life plastics. Once I've recycled physically a plastic bottle, a milk bottle, two or three times, that plastic degrades you can no longer physically recycle it. What we can do is we can chemically recycle that and convert it back to oil to make new plastics, to make the next generation of plastic bottles. And when that comes back again, we can do it all over again. So it's a true circular economy. The CAT SGR process uses water at high pressure and high temperature to cause chemical transformations. The hot, pressurised water cuts the plastics into small pieces like scissors. Catalysts cause these pieces to rearrange to form liquids like waxes, diesel or petrol and gases like ethylene, which is a raw ingredient to make new plastics. The CAT HTR process takes around 20 minutes and has major advantages over competing technologies. It's significantly higher yield, but at a lower energy consumption. There is no repolymerization, so the new products don't become solid again, like they can in other processes. And CAT HDR does not require external hydrogen. We take hydrogen from the water and move it into our products, saving a huge amount of complexity, cost and greenhouse gas emissions. In the UK, the first commercial CAT HDR plant is under development by Renew ELP, backed by renewable energy investment leaders Armstrong Energy. We're excited because this technology is revolutionary. Today, only a minority of plastic waste can be recycled. The rest goes into the ocean or incineration or into landfill at great expense. Meanwhile, we have to dig fossil oil out of the ground to make new plastics. But our CAT HDR plant will turn any plastic waste into synthetic oil that can be used in new plastics, chemicals, waxes, you name it. In this circular economy, everybody wins. Waste producers' landfill costs fall. Renew ELP turns waste plastic into valuable petrochemicals. And in the EU, customers can buy this recycled oil at prices comparable to fossil oil. With Europe already introducing legislation at the forefront of the circular economy, it sets the tone for the future of the chemical industry globally. The world's leading producer of renewable diesel, Neste, has announced a collaboration to accelerate the needed development and commercialization of waste plastic-based products. And this is just the beginning of a global rollout of this breakthrough in chemical recycling. Reducing waste, reducing environmental impact, and creating value at the same time. Cat HTR, a bridge to a lower carbon future.